Welcome everyone to another tutorial from Code Slice. Remember to subscribe and be the first one to catch the upcoming tutorials. All right. So in this tutorial, we'll be dealing with um, with something I think any uh, coder would want to do. Uh, so after you've coded your app, you want to test your app in your Android phone um, or iOS. Um, but in this tutorial, I will be working with Android specifically. Um, so I use an Android device, so I'm able to test the app with Android. Yeah. All right. Um, and also, if I'm also using uh, an, U an Ubuntu operating system. Um, yeah. So this tutorial uh, will help, especially those who are using Ubuntu. All right. And I know that... Um, usually when you compile apps some they use virtual environments yeah so in this tutorial we'll not be using a virtual environment uh yes yeah, so just something for you to um yeah to be aware of anyway let's get started so what do we have here so i have a folder that i created um i have a folder that i, that I created here let me just open it Yes, by the way, um, before doing this tu this tutorial, please do make sure that um, you have sort of already uh, installed Bulldozer. Uh, and how can you install bu uh, Bulldozer? Uh, so simply you, you, you just say uh, pip install uh, Bulldozer. Um, that is how you install it. But in my case, um, it's already um, installed. So yeah. Anyway, uh, let's let's continue on. So I have um, I have my my code here. As you can see, it's quite simple. So it's just a label. So if you run this, as you can see, it's just a label saying hello. Okay. So of course you don't your your code might be more um, in depth or what have you, but yeah. So the same applies whatever your code is. So now let's say you want to now package uh, this app so that you can be able to use it um, in your Android. All right. So what do we do? So number one, we need to open the terminal. Uh, so in my case, I open the terminal in the folder um yes in the folder where my main.py is so open in terminal so that should open the terminal okay as you can see the terminal is now opened the terminal is now opened okay all right so what i do next is i export the path uh, to my locals. So this is something very, very important uh, for me to do. This allows me to be able to then um, use Bulldozer, which is already installed um, in my system. Okay, so let's go on and, and export the path. So export path. Sorry about that. Path. Uh, let me just make this a bit bigger. Mm, like this. Let's move this a bit up. So local bin path. Okay. All right. So now I've exported the path. So what am I going to do now? Now I'm going to finally uh, work on actually packaging the app. So to do that, we need our spec file. All right. So you need the spec file to be able to compile or build your app. Um, so how do we get the spec file? So simply say bulldozer in it. All right. So bulldozer in it. If we run that, as you can see, file bulldozer spec created ready to customize all right so now if we go back to my to our folder here we can see there's a bulldozer spec file 
All right. So the bulldozer spec file allows us to be able to sort of, um, it gives us like a certain control in terms of the packaging of the app, um, such as after it's packaged, what is the name of the app going to be, uh, the version, the icons, the, the permissions, it deals uh, with all of that. Okay, let me just open this so that you can also see it. This is how the spec uh, file looks like. As you can see, it has a lot of things. <laughs> it has a lot of things. So I will break it down. Um, I will break this tutorial into many tutorials where I cover some of the key um, sort of uh, key sort of um, adjustments we can make here and what um, effects it has uh, on our compiled app. All right. Yeah. So for our first um, usage, right? We won't make any change. Actually, I wanna I wanna show you something. So we won't make we won't make any change to our to our bulldozer spec. All right. So if you have your spec and then you have your main load pi, you can just simply run this, <laughs> or you can just simply compile this, and already you'll have a functioning uh, APK. All right. So let's go on and do that. Actually. Yeah. All right, so now that we have our spec um, file ready, what do we do? Now we can just go in and package the file. And how do we do that? We just simply run um, bulldozer Android debug. All right. Yes, once again, I'm not using a virtual environment. So if you are using a virtual environment, you might have to do something like um, EV like this, virtual environment. So bulldozer, Android debug in your virtual environment. All right. Yes. So let's go on and get started. Okay. Yeah. So as you can see, it's starting to compile. All right. Now something about this process, just to let everyone know, this process, especially if you're doing it for the first time, it will take very long. And by very long, I mean <laughs> very, very long. All right. Yes. So I am not going to wait for that long. I'm just going to pause the video and then uh, we'll continue after this whole process is done. All right. Yes. So we, um, it has finished running. So after you have, um, after this finished compile, it's going to, as you're going to see, you're going to see something like this, um, APK, what, what, what available in the bean directory. Okay. So it's available in the bean, um, directory. Yeah. So it's been compiled. Yeah. So where's the bean directly? Yeah. So in that folder, as you can see, so this is the folder we had, this is where our main part is, and this is where our spec file is. So what happened now is that as we were compiling the app, um, there's this uh, folder that, that appeared, the bulldozer folder, and then there is the bin folder. All right. So in the bin folder, this is where you'll find your APK. All right. So this is your APK for the app. So now all you have to do is you have to take this APK um, and copy it or move it to your phone, your Android phone. Uh, and once you move it to your Android phone, you just have to run it, right? Yes. And once you run it, uh, that is how you're going to be able to now um, see um, sort of your app on Android. All right. Um, as you can see, um, this is the APK. I've moved it uh, to my phone and I've already sort of installed it already. Um, okay. So if we now go to the app. So it should look something like this. It's called my application. Um, and you can see the KV uh, logo there. Yeah. So if you open it, as you can see, there is our label um, saying hello. And from Code Slice, um, that is it. And that is how you package your code.